Now, while we've just stumbled across this seemingly insignificant plot of land nestled in the bush, under this soil here lies the bodies of 24 victims of the wreck of the SS Lighty Moon. The Lighty Moon hit a reef off Green Cape on the 30th of May 1886. Of the 86 passengers on board, only 14 survived. Just past the cemetery, we make it to the end of the Light to Light coastal walk here at Green Cape Lighthouse. So Peter, we're now at the top of Green Cape Lighthouse, what a view. Yeah, it's a pretty special little spot, uh, although you probably haven't got it on its uh, best of the weather conditions, but uh, you know, it's one of those locations that uh, it's beautiful no matter what, whether it's rugged and the, the seas are rolling in, smashing in, or uh, the, the sea's all nice and beautiful and blue and so forth. If you live here on site, um, it must feel pretty cool to... Oh, look, I reckon I've got one of the best bits of real estate in Australia, but don't go telling anybody that, will you? A lot of people sort of use it to come down and just unwind, almost a, a forced meditation for some people, and then other people will come down and revel in the, uh, the experience that, that nature has got to offer. Uh, the whale season is one of our busiest times with the whales coming through. Um, and quite often it's not unusual to have whales 10, 10, 15 metres off the rocks down below us here, breaching and so forth. So it's sort of one of those unique uh, little uh, secrets.